Samsung Galaxy S21 versus iPhone 14 Pro. Now both have 0.5, well half X on the wide angle lens. A bit of flowers action. Let's see a macro. Available on iPhone, not available on this Samsung. This is S21, the regular version. See the difference is huge. Let's continue with about the video stabilization. Both looks rubber. Exception. Now regular lens, which is one X. Okay, one X in both. Again flowers. Again auto focus. Hmm. Well, it all depends when the camera stands. They both rubber. Fantastic. Look at the sky. I'm quoting what I see on a smartphone and I'm telling you iPhone is more real life because Samsung is of course oversaturated quite significantly, but that's what the Samsung is. Let's walk a little bit. Green. Why so green? Algae. Water. And now, telephoto. Is this the right way to do it? Probably not. Maybe this will be a better way to do it. 3X and 3X in both phones. Well, I think iPhone is a software image. 4-5X. Let's see, 5 on the both smartphones. I still think iPhone is the better image. And 9X, uh, I think it's the maximum for the iPhone and Samsung. Well, Samsung has 12, but iPhone has 9 with a maximum. I still think iPhone is the better image. It was like three times more expensive, but you could, with Samsung can go all the way to 12. 12. X. Let's go back to the wide angle. There you go. I'm going to spin that rack. And there we go. Full length of my arm. Oof. What a fun image quality and audio quality now what about front facing camera but in mind this is 4k 30 frames per second wait we didn't test the autofocus on one x both really good on wide angle unfortunately samsung doesn't have that regular version ultra has that but there's not an ultra and the pro have the fantastic autofocus look at my skin now that's a difference anyway front facing camera in 4k 30 of course we can go all the way to 60 but this will be on, the, on, on another video not on this one testing all the lenses and with 30 frames per second it's uh, quite uh, pleasant for me to test those lenses and uh, I have to turn off and turn on every time I want to change the lens now that's the difference but what about sky sky is important iPhone is doing it look at the, look at the exposure three two one and they're both pretty good. Samsung is also pretty, pretty good. It's a flagship, 2021 flagship, which is also really, really good stuff. 
Wow. Tremendously good with the iPhone. What about some colors of the stars? Also really good. So, there you go. iPhone 14 Pro versus Galaxy smartphone. Thanks for watching and see you next video. Bye.